Hello there. We're going to be walking along uh, the Malecon Beach. It's not really the official name, but that's how people call it. We're starting off by the Los Milenios sculpture, right by Hotel Rosita. In the past, there was a, a creek called Los Coamecates that ended right there. And this was called El Embarcadero, which was the place where the ships would arrive and people would unload supplies by um, through, uh, on small boats. We're walking along right beside the fishermen's co-op and we will be arriving in front of the, the the sculpture by Pedro Tello called Origin and, and Destination or Origin and Destiny. There's a public toilet if necessary underneath that sculpture and that's right on the corner of Allende and the Malecón. You can see some little houses along the Malecón. This was here in December 2021. They were used as small little stores during the Christmas celebrations. You can see the Papan Papantla pole flyers, the birdmen preparing. They, they have um, shows every 50 minutes between 10 in the morning and 2 uh, two o'clock in the afternoon and then from 6 to 10 30 p.m. 6 p.m. to 10 30 p.m. <coughs> every 15 minutes. We're continuing along the, the, the road. We've already gone by. Well, actually, we're right at the corner of um, Pipila and the Malecón. Looking back now, you can see Hotel Rosita. And Nostalgia, Nostalgia, that is the sculpture right on the corner of um, Pipila and the Malecón. The pole, uh, the pole flyers are located between Pipila and Leona Vicario, the streets. What else can I say? They, well, it's, there's a whole story around what they're doing there, so if you visit or if you search, uh, by uh, Papanta Pole Flyers Puerto Vallarta you'll arrive at the article where I describe their uh, traditions and what they're actually doing you know? could seem a little bit strange you know? here now we're um, just about arriving by the, the on the corner of um, Leona Vicario and the Malecón where you'll find the subtle uh, rock stone eater yeah, stone eater, um, another sculpture th that you'll find on each of each of the corner. We're continuing. You can also see here on the left um, people that are balancing rocks. There's I've seen them in another location. I don't know if this, they're the same people. They're in the corner of Galeana, there where the lighthouse is, and the Malecon. There's another group of people. Maybe it's the same people. I don't know. You can check it out. But they. They balance rocks. Don't forget to, to give them a tip. Same with the Papanta uh, pole flyers. Give them a good tip. <laughs> they really work hard. We can see now here on the left side the the good luck unicorn. Another one of the sculptures. That means that we're right by the corner of uh, Josefa Ortiz de Dominguez and the Malecon the boardwalk. This is not a beach for sunbathing and swimming. There's no, there's no lifeguard, and it's not the best of beaches. It's just something that, and it's also a beach that changes a lot with time. So you'll see that at time you'll see it big, uh, wide as he, it was here with low, low tide. Sometimes the beach is almost completely covered with water, and it'll, it'll change both with the season and if there have been any storms going through the bay. The, the, the sands get taken away. It's a, it's a very dynamic and uh, variable beach. It's known as the Malecon Beach now, but I don't think that's the official name. But we'll uh, update that if I get the information. You can see here now Nature's Mother, another one of the sculptures. That means we're right on the corner of Vasolo and the Malecon. You can see in the background the mandala backwards now. Mandala is right on the corner of Abasola and Malecon, a very well-known uh, night club. Okay, so now we're about to 
stop the recording and hopefully the it's of some use the beach continues further along but close to corona it becomes rocks and it's very hard to cross over to the other side there's a little piece between galeana and saragossa but it's not very much of a beach this would be the most useful part of it anyway hope you like the video and if it's helpful give it a like comment thanks for watching